Hi guys, welcome to Learn Chinese with Jennifer. Today, let's talk about the chopsticks. What about chopsticks? Well, chopsticks are the tools the Chinese people use to eat. Chopsticks in Chinese is kuai zi. Let's take a closer look at these two characters. Kuai zi. Kuai, the upper part of kuai means bamboo, and the lower part of kuai means fast. So if you use bamboo to eat, it will help you speed up with your food. And zi here means just to make a pair of another word, like zhuo zi, deng zi, yi zi, it's a pair word. Well, in English, it's called chopsticks. You know, to my ears, it's not a good translation. The chopsticks is like you make a branch from a tree and make it a stick, and then you chop it shorter so you can use them to eat. So chopsticks is not a good translation for what actually Chinese people are using to eat. The better translation is just quite. Well, to be honest, the pronunciation of zi is a little bit tricky to foreigners. Just listen to my friend John how to say it at the first time. Jennifer. Hi, John. So, you know, there are some pronunciations that are quite difficult for foreigners. Yeah, I was going to ask you about that because I have a really hard time pronouncing the last part, the sound of like. Mingza, Balza, Jiaoza. Okay. Yes, that, that that's sounds one. very hard for a person from Southern California to make. So I have a hard time making. Can you help me with that, please? Yes, uh, Z is just one of the most hard pronunciations for foreigners to learn Chinese. You are pronouncing it like Z, Z, uh, Z, uh, Z, but actually it's Z, E, Z. So um, you close your your teeth, upper teeth and lower teeth together, and then you leave a little gap between your tongue and your upper teeth and uh, lower teeth. You you leave a tiny gap there, make the sound. Z. 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 Yeah, and, and then you say Z. Z. And then you make the tip of your tongue to touch the teeth. Okay. Z. 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 I hear you say Z. Uh, now let's say Z. Z. <laughs> <laughs> I, I can tell you the major problem here is because it all sounds the same to my ear. <laughs> okay. Okay. My, let's say Ming Zi. Ming Zi. Ming Zi. Ming Zi. Yeah, it's not bad at all. Okay, let's see. Kwai zi. Kwai zi. Wow, brilliant. That's wonderful. I'll never be able to say it again. <laughs> all right, now let's pronounce the character together. Zi. 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 Kwai zi. Kwai zi. Kwai zi. Alright guys, I hope you guys had a better understanding of what quiz is and how to make the zi pronunciation better. If you like my video, please give a thumbs up and share. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!